The game field consists of an arena having a dimension of 4800mm by 4800mm. It also contains a manual bot zone. Only the manual bot can maneuver in this zone. It is indicated by green color in the arena. Manual start zone. The manual bot must start the game from this zone. A pit containing balls. The dimensions of the pits are 600mm by 540mm and would contain balls of diameter 67mm. Wooden inclines. Restricted zone. It is the zone between the two inclines. Autonomous bot zone. Only the autonomous bot can maneuver in this zone. It is indicated by grids in the arena. Autonomous start zone. The autonomous bot must start the game from this zone. Block. The dimension of each block used in the gameplay is 150mm by 150mm by 100mm. Deposit zones and a gate. Grid. This zone consists of white grid lines on a black surface. There are nodes at the intersection of two white lines at some places. The nodes are black squares of dimension 30mm by 30mm. The squares of the grids have inner dimensions of 300mm by 300mm. The width of the white lines is 30mm. Bot Specifications Autonomous Bot The dimensions of the autonomous bot are such that it completely fits in a box of dimensions 300mm by 250mm by 200mm. The size of the gripper is not included in this constraint. Bot Specifications Manual Bot During the start of the run, the manual bot must fit within the box of dimensions 400mm by 300mm by 400mm. It must have a ball throwing mechanism. The external remote control used to control the bot is not included in the size constraint. It is the year 2040. Jack, member of a special unit of Black Ops, is carrying out a covert op in the values of Denam. He is after sensitive information of the government relating to nuclear warheads. His mission was to recover the info. Jack feels something wrong when his handler does not respond to his signal. Jack tries to flee but gets apprehended by the VAS. VAS is a group of mercenaries who kill innocent people for money, leak sensitive info and even new countries. VAS is feared by all the countries in the world. Gameplay The manual bot starts from the manual start zone and the autonomous bot starts from the autonomous start zone. The manual block first encounters the pit containing balls. If the bot fails to cross this, it will be allowed to enter the manual zone but with a penalty of 30 points. After crossing the pit, the manual bot would find key block that it has to transfer to deposit zone 1. Meanwhile, the autonomous bot must start from the autonomous start zone. It has to solve the grid by following the white lines, avoiding the nodes. Autonomous bot has to find the secret block carry it over its head and then reach to deposit zone 1. Note that the autonomous bot cannot cross the deposit zone 1 unless the manual bot drops the cover block in it. The autonomous bot must now enter the restricted zone. The manual bot has to pick up the secret block placed over the head of the autonomous bot and cross over it. The manual bot after crossing the incline has to deposit the secret block in deposit zone 2. Meanwhile. The autonomous bot has to take the key block. Once the manual bot successfully deposits the secret block in deposit zone 2, the autonomous bot can now cross over it and deposit the key block in deposit zone 3. The autonomous bot now has to move to the barrier zone and push the barrier, rotating it about the hinge which will make way for the manual bot to reach the opponent's side. The manual bot has to rescue the jack block from the VAS base and drop it in a safe zone marked as yellow color in the arena. Finally, the manual bot establishes its supremacy by projecting a ball on VAS base by standing at the aiming zone.